Here's John Derringer. Or Ryan Parker. How are you? Welcome to Derringer at your desk. I am subbing in last minute for John, who was called away. He had mm-hmm. to leave uh, right after the show today. So uh, I'm like the Rance Mullinex clutch. They called me up last second. And I know what you're thinking. You are way too bald to be on the internet. But here we are anyways on Derringer at your desk. It's a lot of fun. Uh, you know what this reminds me of? The Glutton Bowl. I don't know if you've ever caught this, Billy or Johnny. But what it is, it's uh, they get some people that are professional eaters. And it's a big event. It's shown on American television, and they have them eat tons of different things. And one of the most famous world eaters is a guy named Kobayashi, who you'd think would be a big fella, but he's not. He's actually quite small, and uh, he got his um, fame from eating a lot of hot dogs, and he can eat them rather quickly. So we thought, oh, you know, let's keep this on the food level. So here's a clip, and we brought a clip here, of Kobayashi from a few years ago eating hot dogs. Go ahead, show that clip. Three-time defending champ Takiro Kobayashi hoping to swallow the competition again at this year's Nathan's Hot Dog eating contest. He started off strong eating 17 in the first three minutes. Eric Booker struggling to keep those dogs down, but Kobayashi. famous have we seen 51 dogs. Kobayashi may indeed do that. He is a magician. He is arguably the best athlete practicing any sport today. Kobayashi with 36 seconds left. Kobayashi's up to 52. 52, a new world record. Unbelievable. Kobayashi. Did he say the best athlete Yeah, anywhere? I was wondering about that myself. I mean, the man can shove hot dogs in his yeah. mouth. Got his second win. He threw down 1.5 more. History has been made in Coney Island at Nathan's Famous today. Never in the 89-year history of this contest have we seen that many hot dogs in 12 minutes. You know, you will never forget where That's you were. That's pretty amazing. That, uh, <laughs> that to me really is an Congratulations to Kobe Ashi, who still has done very well. Now, what they didn't show there, but what they often do in the... <laughs> In the glutton bowl, and honestly, this is going to take me a second. We're going to try to do this. Uh, they to to get the hot dogs down, they'll separate the hot dog from the bun. Yeah, the bun has to be a part of it. The right? The bun has to be a part of it for it to go in the books. I mean, this is a professional, Billy. This is an amateur. Okay, this is, this sure. is not bush league here. Mm-hmm. So they take the the wiener out of the hot dog, and they eat the hot dog, which is the easier part. The hard part is getting the bread down. So what they do to help that out is they wet the bread. Oh. Uh, so what we've done here is I went and picked up some hot dogs. Billy, you're going to join me, I think, in this. Yeah, oh, I'm looking forward to this. Now, this, honestly, there's two things I have a real hard time even thinking and pretending uh, to eat and, and, and getting in my head is egg salad sandwiches and wet bread. Both, I just don't trust the way egg salad moves, and wet bread is disgusting. And true story, at the house the other day, I made a sandwich, I put it down, it was next to the sink, I didn't put it on a plate because I'm like a caveman when the wife's not around, and the bread got wet. I threw it out. Yeah. I threw out a brand new sandwich because I can't handle it. Understandable. So, it's going to be really tough. We're going to dip? We're going to dip. Oh! Go, Billy. Oh! So, Ryan, do you, want me to, do you want me to time this? Maybe 30 seconds, see how many buns you guys can get down? Oh. <laughs> I, I'm guessing mine will be one, but absolutely. Time right. it. I'll get okay. two ready. Are you kidding me? Oh. So, okay. So hold on. Oh, Let me just man. reset this here. All right. Are you guys ready? You guys if get there's, water? I, I got to okay, have so a disclaimer. Let's just go over this. It has to, the whole thing has to be wet, or, or can you dip it as you go? I had the same conversation with my, with my wife last week. <laughs> now you can dip as you go. All right. All right. You ready? Okay. Come here we go. So listen, disclaimer, if there's any children, there's a good chance I'm going to throw up. So um, you may want to look away. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh. 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 <laughs> it's wet. It's wet. And it's cold. That's not good. I had to take a drink. Whoa. Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> 15 more seconds, guys. Keep oh. it going. You're doing great. Glad it doesn't have mustard. 10 more mm. seconds. You guys are unbelievably quick. <laughs> I don't need to do another one, do I? And that's time. <laughs> oh. There you go. 30 seconds. Way to go, guys. Way to go, guys. I need a bucket. <laughs> oh, that is not good. Oh. <laughs> just spit it on the floor. Okay, then. Well, that's classy. Hmm. I'm sorry, but I can't do it. Oh, man. I got through a quarter of a bun. That was tough. That's really tough. Try that one at home. Maybe you can let us know. You know what we should do? Toast them first. Oh, God. Even that. Y- you know what? Wow. No, that's, that still wouldn't work. That's disgusting. Uh, maybe <laughs> maybe you can let us know what disgusts you. Maybe we can try to do it next week. Everyone on the cameras are laughing at me. That is, honestly, oh, that, is, that is disgusting. So thank you very much for Dar- Derringer at your desk. Uh, John will be back next week. Uh, he had to be called out kind of last minute. So thanks, John, for giving the opportunity to do this. Thank you, Billy. Thank you, Mr. Garbutt, Karina, Martin, Chris. Thanks very much for watching. And make sure you check in next Wednesday, 9.15, for Derringer at your desk. 
If you think today started the wrong